Pierre André Alentro, November 29, 1762, February 6, 1833, was a French zoologist, specializing in arthropods. Having trained as a Roman Catholic priest before the French Revolution, Latral was imprisoned, and only regained his freedom after recognizing a rare beetle species he found in the prison, Necrobia ruficolis. He published his first important work in 1796, Précis des Caractères Génériques des Insects, and was eventually employed by the Muséum National d'Histoire Naturelle. His foresighted work on arthropod systematics and taxonomy gained him respect and accolades, including being asked to write the volume on arthropods for George Cuvier's monumental work, Le Ren Animal the only part not by Cuvier himself. Luttrell was considered the foremost entomologist of his time, and was described by one of his pupils as the prince of entomologists. Biography Early Life Pierre-André Luttrell was born on November 29, 1762 in the town of Brive, then in the province of Limousine, as the illegitimate child of Jean-Joseph Saigat de Marset. General Baron de Spagnac, and an unknown mother, the surname Luttrell was formally granted to him in 1813, and derives from a nickname of unclear provenance. Luttrell was orphaned at an early age, but had influential protectors, first a physician, then a merchant from Brive, and later a baron and his family, after the baron's death, who brought him to Paris in 1778. He studied in the College du Cardinal Lemoyne to become a priest, initially in Brive, and later in Paris. He entered the Grand Seminaire of Limoges in 1780, and left as a deacon in 1786. Despite being qualified to preach, Luttrell later wrote that he had never carried out his functions as a minister, although for a few years he signed the letters he wrote La Luttrell, the Reverend Luttrell or Lentrell, Preacher, Lentrell, Priest. Even during his studies, Luttrell had taken on an interest in natural history, visiting the Jordan du Roi planted by Georges Louis Leclerc, Comte de Buffon, and catching insects around Paris. He received lessons on botany from René Justhoy, which allowed him to meet Jean-Baptiste Lamarck. Necrobia ruficolis after the fall of the ancient regime and the start of the French Revolution, the civil constitution of the clergy was declared in 1790, which required priests to swear an oath of allegiance to the state. Luttrell failed to do so and was therefore imprisoned in November 1793 under threat of execution. When the prison's doctor inspected the prisoners, he was surprised to find Luttrell scrutinizing a beetle on the dungeon floor. When Luttrell explained that it was a rare insect, the physician was impressed, and sent the insect to a 15-year-old local naturalist, Jean-Baptiste Bory de Saint Vincent. Bory de Street Vincent knew Luttrell's work, and managed to obtain the release of Luttrell and one of his cellmates. All the other inmates were dead within one month. The beetle had been described by Johann Christian Fabricius in 1775, but recognizing it had saved Luttrell's life. Thereafter, Luttrell lived as a teacher and corresponded with various entomologists, including Fabricius. In 1796, and with Fabricius' encouragement, Luttrell published his Bracy des Caractères Génériques des Insects at his own expense. He was briefly placed under house arrest in 1797, and his books were confiscated, but the influence of Georges Cuvier, Bernard Germain de la Cepide and Jean-Baptiste Lamarck, who all held chairs of zoology at the recently instituted Museum National d'Histoire Naturelle, succeeded in freeing Luttrell. In 1798, Luttrell was appointed to the museum where he worked alongside Lamarck, curating the arthropod collections, and published a number of zoological works. First Empire, 
Following the death of Guillaume Olivier in 1814, Luttrell succeeded him as titular member of the Académie des Sciences de l'Institut de France. In the following few years, Luttrell was especially productive, producing important papers for the Memoirs du Museum, all of the volume on arthropods for George Cuvier's Le Ren Animal, The Animal Kingdom, and hundreds of entries in the Nouveau Dictionnaire d'Histoire Naturelle on entomological subjects. As Lamarck became blind, Luttrell took on an increasing proportion of his teaching and research work. In 1821, Luttrell was made a Knight of the Legion d'Honneur. In 1829 he succeeded Lamarck as Professor of Entomology. Later years, from 1824, Luttrell's health deteriorated. He handed his lectures over to Jean Victoire Radoun and took on several assistants for his research work, including Amity Louis Michel Lapelladier, Jean Guillaume Mordenet Serville, and Felix Edouard Garin Meneville. He was instrumental in the founding of the Societe Entomologique de France, and served as its honorary president. Luttrell's wife became ill in 1830 and died in May of that year. The date of Luttrell's marriage is unclear, and his request to be released from his vow of celibacy was never acknowledged. He resigned his position at the museum on April 10, 1832, in order to move to the country and thereby avoid the cholera epidemic. He returned to Paris in November, and died of bladder disease on February 6, 1833. He had no children but was survived by a niece whom he had adopted. Mm -hmm.